Hey all and welcome to my playthrough of the levels submitted for round 15 of the 12 item challenge. The level you can see on the screen is the level I made. This is called the Mysterious Cavern. I made a clear condition level that has cheese. The idea behind this level is to get one of the swords and then reach the end. However, because the level is made up of mostly question mark blocks, there's some major cheese in the level. So there we go, that's what the level looks like. Let's go back to the start. Here we go, a little bit faster. Right, let's play the level from the start so you can see what it's like. Now at the start you have to jump and then the on-off blocks change. If you're too slow you fall down like that. So you want to go quite fast. At this point you get the Master Sword. I'm not going to reveal where the cheese is. If you want to see the cheese then have a look at the video in the pinned comment. This shows the level in more detail. I'm sure you can work it out though if you think about it. Link has bombs and the level's made up of question mark blocks. There's the big clue. Right anyway this is how you play the level normally. Use the bow at this point. Just be careful here. It's not too difficult. The hardest part is right at the start. And then that's the entire level. Just be careful of the thwomp there. The intended method here is to jump off the cannonball and then hit the top of the flagpole like so. But you can just go across on the vines or just run across. So there we go, that's the level I made. Now let's begin the playthrough. Alright, and here's the very first stage submitted for this round of the 12 item challenge. 12 I see rummage through the desert, this is by Kevin. This has a surprisingly low clear rate for one of Kevin's levels as well. Let's give it a go and see how well I actually do at the stage. Hopefully I will be able to complete the stage. Oh, okay, we've got spinies and a desert at night. Oh, okay, I've got to be quite careful. Alright, so I guess, ah, a bomb is going to blow that up, I think. No. Alright, so jump up on the cannon. There we go. Oh! Well, I didn't expect the bomb at that point. And then, well, I died. I died. There's a platform in the corner, though. I'm wondering how I can get to that platform. I'm going to try. There we go. It wasn't particularly difficult. Oh, hold on. Is this cheese, maybe? Is this a shortcut? See if I can get to that other platform. No, I don't think I can jump across to there, so... Let's just play the stage. Oh boy. No, I'm okay, I'm okay. Right, last time I dropped down and the bomb got me. This time I'm going to drop down a bit more careful. Oh! The cannon nearly got me that time. Okay. We're good so far. Um, I'm not sure what you're supposed to do here. Probably go up on the platforms. 
I'm watching that spiny. All right, all right. Where's that going? Ah, I see. No, the wind's the wind picked up at that point. And guess what happened? Well, you don't need to guess because I died. I died. I'm liking this stage so far though. Kind of feels like the sort of stage I would make actually. Lots of question mark blocks. Lots of bombs. Lots of platforms. All right, I'm gonna beat this. Maybe. If I could even get onto the vine it would help, wouldn't it? Oh, come on, Mario. Get your fat butt up there. There we go. Now the spiny's moved just as I've jumped. That's a shame. I thought I might beat it on that attempt. Clearly not. All right, well, I will get this down. I hope. 1.5% clear right? This should be easy, in theory. I don't think there's a sub-world. I don't remember pipes being in this set. What am I doing? Come on, just jump up. Jump up. Jump up. It's simple. There we go. Okay. Spiny. And this time... Uh, I'm okay, I'm okay, I'm okay. This time, wait before... Oh, now it's gone down by itself. Right. Spiny again. I'm going to wait for that spiny to come down here before I try and progress. Oh, my goodness. Look at all those platforms. I think that's the end of the level, though. Oh, no. Boss. There's a boss. Ah, swamps as well, okay. Question mark blocks have spinies in. Sugar. I need to say something very rude then. I didn't. I refrained from swearing. Alright, I want one of those mushrooms. I can try and damage boost through. Okay. Where's that thwomp going? Ah, it's not moving, okay. That one is. Oh boy! Oh right! I'm looking. Okay, um. Where am I supposed to go? Well, I'm back up to the top now. I have no idea where you're actually supposed to go. Is there an on-off switch that you're supposed to hit? That's my thought. Oh no, I've taken damage. Right, let's just try and get to the bottom. Hold on, there's bombs. So I could try and blast through the question mark blocks. I don't think that's going to help though. I think that's the ending over there. Oh, wait a sec. Well, I managed to get away with that. Duck down, and is that it? I've done it. There we go. Well, that ending was tough. Made me quite nervous that ending did actually, but yeah, that was a really good stage. Had a lot of fun playing that stage. I'm going to try and speed run it as well, see if I can get near to that world record. So here we go.
All right, so here's the next stage called 12 items, one screen. So this looks like an underwater one screen puzzle. Okay. That's a very interesting and strange idea. Let's play the stage and see how well I actually do at it. I'm not very good at one screen puzzles, but this is quite a high clear rate level. And just hit that. That can't be the end of the level, no? No, it's not. I didn't think it would be that easy. Uh-oh. What happened there? Cannon squashed me. Well, the coins tell you what you need to do, supposedly. I don't get it. I am confused. I am very confused. It's just saying up. Maybe take damage and then... No. Oh, hold on. Maybe I was right. Is that it? Lose the spiny helmet and then... Hit the bomb. Well, that was... Ridiculously easy once I've worked it out. Let's give it another go. Just to see if that was what you had to do. So it's just a case of losing the cannon. I mean, losing the shelmet, like so, and then just doing that. I just feel there's something else to this level that I've missed. But that might be the entire level. Anyway. I will give it a like. It's kind of an interesting idea. It's a little bit strange though. It confused me a little bit. I'm like, oh, is that all you have to do? But let's see if I can get that world record as well. So here we go. All oh, right, so here's the next stage called Aurum Venari. You've got one minute to collect the gold. So I'm going to guess this is a clear condition level where you have to collect the coins. So let's play the stage and see how I get on. Yeah, there's the clear condition, 35 coins. There's question mark blocks here as well, so I'm wondering if they contain coins. Yes, they do. Oh, wait a sec. That's the end of the level. Um... That was much shorter than I was expecting. Put it that way. So, how am I supposed to get the rest of the coins? Right, well, I'm going to run out of time. 
So I need to hit every single question mark block as well. How are you supposed to get the last few? Oh, wait a sec. Okay. And I've beaten it. There we go. That was quite a strange level. That was interesting, though. Collecting the coins level. I don't think that's the sort of stage... I can speed run. Well, I probably could, but it would be very difficult. So I'm going to move on to the next stage. All right, so here's the next stage. 12 IC, 15 traps in the shadows. Where'd the floor go? Eight clears so far. Let's play the stage. Here we go. Short and sweet and themed. Okay, oh, that was... Oh, wait a sec. Right, so... It's on-off switch over here. Well, I thought I was going to die at that point, but no, I'm okay. Well, okay. There's lots going on. I don't know how I'm still alive, to be honest. But there we... I was going to say, there we go. I've beaten the level. But I got trolled right at the end. But there we go. I have actually done it. That was quite an interesting idea for a level. I'm not going to try and speed run this level, though. Speedrunning a level that's in the dark is an absolute nightmare. So let's move on to the next stage. All right, so here we go, the next stage, dashing through the sand. I'm a little bit concerned about this one as no one has cleared it yet. 0.00% clear rate. 336 attempts. Can I be the first one to clear it? Probably not, but here we go. Right. Collect 100 coins to beat the stage. Let's give this a go. Oh. Well, that's a very difficult jump to start. I see how you're supposed to do that. Doesn't mean I can actually do it, but there we go. Man. Yeah. 100 coins in 30 seconds. You gotta be having a laugh. This is going to be way, way, way way too difficult for me I would have thought I can't even get the third coin on most of my attempts yeah, you need to make your levels at a sort of level that's actually possible would be nice what's up the vine anyway let's have a look up the vine ah oh, there's another coin here the thing about this level is it's not even obvious what route you're supposed to take through the level. 
made a very non-linear coin collecting level with a tight timer and that's always going to be very 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 difficult so I think it's time to abandon that level I'll give it a like I know I'm not going to be able to beat that stage so let's move on to the next stage All right, so here's the next stage, round XV Annoying Thwomps 3. Thwomps, Bobombs, Spinies and Cannons are your enemies. Keep Mushroom till end. Well, here we go. Right, reach the goal as Super Mario. Right, that, that, that's okay, that's okay. Right, here we go. I see what you have to do here, just be careful. Okay. Right. There's a lot going on here. The stage looks beatable so far. However, I need to clean... Clear the stage while big. Yeah. You need to clear the stage while big. So I've got to be really, really, really careful. That I don't take damage from anything. Well, that was good. Okay. All right. Well, this is looking extremely dangerous now. How on earth was I even supposed to get up there? It doesn't matter though, as there's another mushroom here. Right. So I need to keep this mushroom. I need to keep this mushroom and guess what happened? I died! Yeah, that's really hard. Right. Okay, let's get back to where I was before. As I know, I can damage boost through the one part. Really? I fell through the blocks. Well, that's a little bit annoying. What was that? What was that? Seriously? Okay, well, I'm making stupid mistakes now. I'm not sure if this is even the intended method. Right. Be careful. Be careful. Okay, so this time I didn't actually die at that point. So this point here I can actually damage boost through. So it doesn't really matter if I lose the mushroom. But now we are at this point which is hard. Okay, well I've managed to keep the mushroom so far, which is pretty good going actually. 
I'm not sure how I've managed to do that. Is there another mushroom over here? No. Red cannons. Red cannons. Oh, come on. Ah. Another mushroom, that's good. I've actually done it. Oh no, look at that wall of bombs. Oh, come on. Oh, come on. I had that. I had that in the bag. There's got to be a mushroom in one of these blocks. There's got to be. Come on. I don't want coins. I want a mushroom. Guess what? There's no mushroom. Oh, that's really, really annoying. Well, I'm rage quitting. That was quite an interesting stage, but... Yeah. I should have had that beaten. Okay, so I will get a clear on this level. And once I've beaten the stage, I will move on to the next stage. Alright, so here's the next stage called Capture the Shroom. Can you capture the mushroom in time? You interesting. 250 seconds to try and get the mushroom. This could be quite fun. This could also be quite evil. Let's play the stage and see how I get on. Alright. Reach the goal as Super Mario. Yeah, I was kind of expecting that. Oh, there's no music. Right. It's so nothing too difficult so far except I need to somehow get a mushroom. Okay. I need to somehow not drop down and die as well. No one has beaten this stage yet, so can I be the first one to manage it? Probably not. Well, that was pretty good. This kind of feels like some sort of evil troll level where it's impossible to actually get the clear condition done. I'm hoping there is a mushroom that you can actually get at some point. Otherwise, this is going to be a major problem. Alright, so at this point, we'll jump up carefully and 
Try not to die on the bomb. That was very, very close. Ah! There's a lone question mark block there. Does that have a mushroom in? No, it has a vine in instead. Right. Oh, there's the mushroom. Is that it? I was expecting something really difficult for that mushroom, but no, that was really easy to actually get the mushroom. It's just up and there. So I have the first clear on this stage. That was quite a cool idea. Nowhere near as difficult as I was expecting. So let's try and speed run the level now. Here we go. Okay, so this, I think, is the last stage. There might be one more stage submitted a bit later on. I'm not sure about that yet. This one is called The Great Rupee Fairy. On a speed run by the looks of it, 100 coin challenge. Let's play the stage. I am intrigued by that description. All oh, right, so, oh. Another hundred coins, but seven coins. Um, seven. That's done already. Right. So that's very, very strange to have a clear condition that's that easy to do. I'm not complaining though. On off switch over there. Oh, that's the whole level. Okay, that was unexpected. I was expecting the level to be a bit longer and considerably harder than that. Let's give it a like. I'm going to play it again. I kind of feel like I missed out half the stage. It's very strange. On off switch there. What if I hit that? Let's try this. Right. Ah. Yeah, okay. Maybe I didn't want to do that. Or maybe I did. I don't know. Right, I just want to try something. If I turn off all the blocks, I wonder if the level's beatable. Oh, wait a sec. I think I've worked it out. Without the on-off switch on, it's a speed run. With it on, it's an easy level. Well, that's actually a co cool idea. This took me a bit of time to work out. This is two levels in one, basically. However, how are you supposed to get seven coins... With it all on blue. Let's have a think about this. I think you have to shoot the coins at the start. Right. 
So the fastest method to beating this level is to leave it all off like this. Yeah, so that's considerably faster. That's a cool idea. I've made a stage like this before where it's harder if all the blocks are turned off, but you can beat it either way. So let's see if I can get anywhere near that world record. Here we go. Alright, so this is actually the final level. This was submitted after I had played all the other levels. So I'm going to give it a go now. It's got no clears yet. Put together in an hour. Okay. Let's give it a go and see how well I actually do at the stage. This will probably be quite difficult based on the fact that no one has cleared it yet. Right. Okay, um... I'm not sure what you're supposed to do. You're supposed to go on the coins at the left. I see, right. So I think... What you're supposed to do with this level is follow the coins, but that jump looks impossible. I think you need to do that in one go. So like that, there we go, and then grab the vine. That's not too difficult so far. Then over... Oh, wait a sec. Those thwomps look a bit menacing. I don't want to drop down as I can't see what's down. So let's try and damage boost across on the thwomps. Oh, wait a sec. I'm wondering if you can cheese over the top of the level. Is there a clear condition on this stage? No. So let's give this a try. Yeah, it's very, very difficult to jump that far. I think I will try and do it the legit way. It did say on Facebook there may be cheese in the level. I kind of feel that might be the way to cheese the level, but I'm not going to try it again. Okay, so we're still alive. Yay, and okay, so I need to wait for the cannonball. Right, so at that point, just be careful and then wait for the cannonball to go across. Jump, jump, jump. Jump quickly. Drop down slowly. Cannonball! There we go! On the bombs. Right, on the bombs. Well, that's really awkward as you're turning left and right in midair. But I'm getting further and further with each attempt, which is good. I don't think it's actually that difficult. It's just a case of learning the level and not doing really stupid stuff like that. I'm sure I can beat this. I'm only going to give it around 5 to 10 minutes on this. Oh my goodness. I'm going to give it a like as well, just in case I do quit out. As I was saying, give it 5 to 10 minutes. If I can't beat it unedited, I will practice the level and then hopefully get a clear run in. I'm sure I can beat this. 
Nothing so far looks super impossibly difficult. It's just a case of learning where everything is. And, yeah, actually... Landing on the cannonball would help. Would help a lot, but it didn't happen. As you saw. Right, so I need to go a little bit faster, I think, at this point. The cannonball went too far ahead. Then over, over, perfect, right. Oh, that was really, really close. Wasn't a bad effort, though. I just can't turn quick enough to land on those bombs. Right, so here we go again. Land on the cannonball and then... Yeah, those bombs, that's probably the hardest part of the level. The hardest part so far, anyway. I'm tempted to try and cheese it, but... Yeah. Oh, no, I forgot to jump. I forgot to jump. Never going to do it if I forget to jump. Right, turn. Oh, there we go. Right. This looks extremely dangerous. Well, yeah. Looking at the safer route over the thwomps. Well. Yeah. I don't think that was a good idea. I kind of panicked at that point and thought, hmm, let's try and cheese it again. Right, well I missed the platform. I'm going to give this a few more attempts. Then I'm going to practice the level. Well, what was that? What was that? Really? That was really, 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 really stupid. Right, here we go again. Land on the cannon. Jump, jump, jump. Jump across. Wait. Jump across. Oh, no, no. Miss. Right, okay, I'm going to quit out at this point. I need to practice the level. It's very difficult, but it's a good stage. So I'm hoping I can beat this one. And once I've beaten this stage, that's the final stage. Thank you.
All right, and that's the end of the playthrough. I hope you enjoyed that. Some fun levels submitted there. Often with unique and interesting concepts. If you enjoyed this video, feel free to check out some of my other videos. They're on the screen right now. And thanks for watching.